Are you going to come for my world record? Yeah. My world title? Yeah. I'm going then. Bit. I'm going. <laughs> I'm See you later. A bit nervous about um, meeting Liv. I've been following on Instagram since the beginning of I started freestyle, so since 2020. I definitely aspire to be like Liv because she's got like world records, freestyle and world records as well, so that's really cool. Oh my gosh. Wow. I've actually seen your Instagram videos, so I'm not very <laughs> surprised. I know you've got skill. first start freestyling? Gosh, a long time ago. I'm not actually sure now. <laughs> I think I always played football and liked the skill side of it. Kind of like you, football was everything to me. But I did tricks on the side so I could do a few around the world. Probably before I called myself a freestyler. I mean, you're way better than I was, don't get me wrong. So how old are you, 15? 14. 14. So I probably started, I think, when I was 15. So you're way ahead of me already. <laughs> are you coming for my world title in a few years? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How many world records do you hold? Six, but I'm actually going for my seventh soon. Oh. Yeah, and I'm going to do it in Barcelona. Yeah, I did my first four there. I don't know why. <laughs> Which one's your favourite? Probably my soul juggles. Do you know the one when I'm wet on my back and my feet are in the air? Oh, yeah. that? that one's really cool. <laughs> So when they asked me if I'd break it, the record they told me was 136 soul juggles in 60 seconds. So I was like, that's a lot. Mm. I'll have to get more than two a second to do it. Yeah. So I trained and trained and trained for months and I could do it. And then I get there and the day before and they're like, you ready to break the record? I'm like, yeah, I'm doing pretty good. You know, 136, I'll smash it. And they're like, no, it's 192. I went, you're lying. You're lying, I'm not gonna beat that. <laughs> and oh then something just came over me, you know, in the moment. And I got 217. It was, I, I don't know how I did it to this day. I personally don't think I'll ever beat that. So no. I can't see anyone else ever beating yeah. it. <laughs> yes! Yes! Would you swap all your like freestyle achievements to be a lioness? I love football. I think lionesses are amazing. Mm. And I'm very fortunate that growing up, I did play with a few of them. So like Ella Toon, George Samway, Kira Walsh, we all traveled and we were starting 11 for an academy. And that was my dream, to go and play for England. But then when I was like 16, I got a back injury. And while I was out injured, I didn't want to just be doing nothing. I was like obsessed. Football was my life. Yeah. Tricks, field, anything. I loved it. So I was like sat at home thinking like, what can I do to improve my touch? Because if I go back and I've not practiced for months, I'm going to be on the bench and I can't have that. Yeah. I can't have Ella Toon taking my position. <laughs> so I was like sat down like this, trying to juggle a ball because it didn't hurt my back. And I guess lo and behold that was the start of my freestyle journey and I just didn't know it personally I've had more of an impact on benefiting the women's game being a freestyler than a footballer yeah. I, I love freestyle I love what I do and I love supporting the girls what's your favorite trick to do I really like lower body tricks when you're doing that like around the world and stuff yeah. they're my favorites when I was competing they were my strongest suit and they was also the hardest so they're highly regarded yeah. in competitions so that was very important for me and I think I just really liked what I was good at. I'm like that. If I'm not good at it, I don't like it. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Yeah. Are you going to be a lioness? Yeah. Are you going to be a pro freestyler? Yeah. Are you going to do pro? Are you going to come for my world record? Yeah. <laughs> my world title? Yeah. I'm going well, then. I'm going. <laughs> I'm See <kidding>. you later. <laughs> my friends will definitely be jealous of me meeting Liv. It was really fun. It was exciting and nice to meet Liv and share some tricks. I've already got videos on TikTok and on Instagram, but I'm gonna use some of her ideas and make some more videos. Jasmine's already told me that she's coming for my world title and world records, and you know what? Like, jokes aside, she could. Give it a few years, she might be calling me out. <laughs>